Hey, Sam Kennedy here from Aviation Fargo, and behind me we have the Fairchild PT-19A. This, this was a primary trainer, hence PT. Uh, uh, during the World War II and pre-war times, this one itself was built in 1939, and it actually was a step up from other aircraft. Uh, as you see here is the standard over there. That was a uh, hand prop, but this one's a step up, though. Basically, you turn on the mags, and you prime it a bit, and then you insert the crank, and you crank it, kind of like a Model T or an old tractor. Uh, it's two-seat. There's very other variants of it, like the PT-26, which was actually all metal covered. This one's half fabric, or almost all fabric covered, with a wooden frame on it, or in it. Uh, Top speed is about 130 miles an hour, and it had a fixed fixed landing gear. Uh, you can see it's a tail wheel. The United States Army Air Force or Air Corps uh, used it until 1942, until it was replaced uh, by. It also uh, it was replaced by the AT6 or or the BT13. Uh, that's uh, right up here is a radio. Antenna, a little different looking from on our cars, I, I suppose. Uh, it has a top speed of 130, like I said, and uh, a lot of the. Or this one itself was uh, donated from or on loan from De Bonanza Villas, I believe. So, uh, it's an Army Air Corps scheme, and Canada also used these as well. Or the, they were the other primary user other than the U.S. Army Air Force. We'll come over here to the front. Here we have a two-blade prop, uh, wooden, but you see these uh, guards right here. And down right in here, you can see these little holes. These are for drainage. Uh, when the propeller, since it's made of wood, it'll absorb a lot of water when it gets wet, and it'll drain out through these holes to prevent the propeller from rotting out and it can last a lot longer. You can see we have a six cylinder inline engine right here. Uh, this one itself is flyable but it has not flown as of late. So it is the oldest aircraft flying in the Air Museum right now. Not the oldest one in the museum. The standard is a few years older. So hope you enjoyed this episode of Aviation Fargo. Thanks for watching. Remember to like comment and subscribe on this video. Remember to like our uh, Share Aviation page and our Facebook page. Thanks for watching.